This is Patricio back for more Space Kim with a most unfortunate malfunction. With a fully automatic mining robot. Okay, this is actually pretty simple. All we're going to do is take this methane, put it in a reactor just to pass it down. First to this one, then to this one, and finally to this one. And while this thing is moving down and with each one exploding with methane, damaging the fully automated mining robot. And we're going to just do one for now, although I better go ahead and put in a lower... I'm going to just put that down there. That's all I really need to know to tell me, hey, you better do this correctly. Okay. So the secret to doing this is this guy right there. We don't need red. We don't need bonders. This is just a simple F thin switch, which you can control. Uh, okay, we're grabbing it here with the carbon and my input and my start. And when I move this over here, you can see it's branching out in two different ways. Initially, you went with this guy off. Now we're going to be dropping it there. And have our output. While this guy... We don't really care where it will output from. So... Way. And then all we have to do is connect these two and have it go back. It should work. And since we're moving it there, let's just go ahead and move this one up. Now, if this works correctly, initially it's going to be Control A is off, and we do control A with the F1 key. Control B with the F2. So the initial is going to be off. Drop it here. Output. Then eventually we're going to have to kick this thing on. We'll come up here. Go up instead. Drop it and out. So that, at least for now, appears to work. And the reason why I want to get this one done first is to save the toolbox. This little feature lets you save a design which I'm going to name very appropriately that. has nothing to do with Space Kim except for it's a very appropriate word for Space Kim. Bonus points if you know where that's from. So we're going to place Kovac right there. That'll be better. And ugh. move it up there. And this guy there. And since we're coming it from the bottom, we want to connect to the bottom. And oh yeah, something else that has to change. To B. Yeah. That should work. So initially we're going to be off, then we're going to press F2 when that explodes, F1 when that explodes, then that should explode and we're done with this. We'll find out. F2! F1! Wait, hurry, hurry! Oh, Well, the planet just exploded. <laughs> we're going to try that again. I'm actually being too efficient this time. Okay, now how long will this have to wait? That long? There we go. Okay, good. And no, uh, we don't get anything. I don't think we get anything. Nope, nothing. Oh, sensing. This is an automated F-then switch. 
and what triggers where it will go is depending on what molecule it is when it's above the sensor. So I'm just going to quickly show this guy off. We don't need blue. We don't need bondings. So get that out of the way. So we have our grab here. Our input here. And then we'll move it down to the actual sensor. And you don't have to put this thing on the sensor. It can be placed anywhere, but the molecule will have to be where the sensor is. Okay, so we don't need to worry about where we place it. If it's, we right click it and change trigger element if we want NE, neon is nicely highlighted. It will go this direction, otherwise it will go in this direction. So the earliest we can drop it is there. The earliest we can drop it is there. Then we just have to connect the tracks. And bring it back. Uh, here we can do our output for this one. Output for this one. Fairly simple. Just a new concept, as simple as you can make them. So we got that one, we're passing it down to that output. When will we get our first neon? There we go. Drop, out, and we're done. That's simple. Very few symbol use, that's good better timing, but he's probably people do a uh, parallel. Double the amount of symbols. Faster speed. I prefer this. So let me just tease the next one. Uh, migraine? I've already got a migraine from playing this game. Oh, <laughs> I feel you, bud. I feel you. So, oh, ho, 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 sometimes it's single, sometimes it's two molecules. What are we going to do? Think about that for next time. This is Patricio for Space Kim. Goodbye.